Hello, Amazon.com. It's me, Bo Shevasuk. Today, I'm coming to you with this crazy, surprisingly large wire brush. And as you can see, there's a bit of a spatula end right there. And yes, you can see some grodiness on there because I have been using this for the past week. Oh, hello, Lucy. Yes, we can eat. I'm all done with the meat, but and yet there's still some residue all over here. Oh, look at how clean that is now. Oh, that's beautiful. Now, do keep in mind with all wire brushes that if you were to do this, you should uh, basically try to scrape it off or at least do some kind of spot check to make sure that there are no wire bristles remaining behind. I did take some needle nose pliers and I was able to rip some out of this. Uh, so just, yeah, obviously with, as with all wire brushes, I mean, the wires may come out. So it is effective in cleaning, and that's exactly why I bought this. Uh, yeah, get all the gross residue off, maybe crank up the heat a bit more to burn off all the excess. But uh, yeah, oh boy, that's beautiful. And it has like a little thumb guard right there. And anyway, yeah. It's uh, you know, and a, and a little thing that I can um, basically hook it on there. So that's it. Um, as with all wire brushes, just be do do be wary that uh, yes, they can come off on the grill. But uh, as you can see, you can uh, tell fairly quickly whether or not they do come off. Um, yeah, so they don't, at least in this particular case. Anyway, five out of five stars. Highly recommended. I hope that this small little real world demonstration of this wire brush is helpful in determining whether or not this is the right wire brush for you. My name is Bo Chavisu. I look forward to testing and reviewing more fun things here on Amazon.